Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Capricorn April 16, 2022. Your natural psychic abilities may be short-circuited today. If you give readings, try to avoid doing any. Interference from the minds of people other than your clients could cloud the issue, and this won't do anyone any good. Your imaginative faculties could be rather garbled as well. The best possible advice, take the day for yourself and go for a massage. You can go back to your routine tomorrow. You can count on an idyllic day today. You are feeling warm and sensual, and can't believe your good fortune at having such a wonderful person in your life. Likely this person feels the same way about you, so it is clear that you too are a perfect match. Tonight would be an ideal time for a romantic dinner for two. You need some intimate time together, free of outside responsibilities and interruptions. Today you could step in to protect someone from harm. Maybe there is someone at work who is going through a difficult time. Your boss might be thinking about letting them go. Or they could be having troubles keeping up with their work. You might be able to help them out. Don't do all of their work for them, but don't hesitate to point them in the right direction. Some encouragement could make a difference. You could attend a special financial event at work today, but you won't feel much like talking. You could be content just to listen to what everyone else is saying, enjoying the warmth, and the music, and the company, and feeling very much at peace. You might have been spending too much time at home, and could well have really needed to get out for a while. Relax, sit back in your chair, and enjoy yourself. Not everything in your private life is running as well as you would like. Friends and family have their own wishes and goals and are not bound to show consideration to you. Even though it's tough, accept that some situations will not run according to plan. Try to change your perspective and understand others' points of view. This is the best strategy at present. You're feeling that surge of great energy that always comes just when you need it most. You may have felt a bit out of sorts lately, but you can easily get yourself back where you need to be now. If you are longing for love and the feeling of security this brings, don't always pursue it with such vigor or be overly concerned if a love you want isn't always available. You can get what you want by taking your time, being a little more relaxed and calm. A brand new outlook brings with it the promise of success. You could be in the mood to reach out to others. It's possible that you've been a bit too isolated in recent weeks. You've probably been very busy sorting out your own career and financial issues. Now it's time to breathe a little and appreciate simply being alive. Connect with some friends and make some new acquaintances. It's time to be social and share some light conversation. This can be a wonderful day for you to have some fun. The vibration that's happening will bring the perfect environment to head out. If you can, round up your family, especially your children if you have any, and take in an event. When is the last time you visited the zoo or enjoyed an afternoon matinee? Later this evening, you may be in the mood for a little romance. Set up some time with that special person. As the moon leaves Leo this will leave you with your instincts sharp and with perfect timing. These monthly visits are always a valuable chance to check in, both with your own inner voice and the ever-changing cosmic conditions while leaving you more emotionally and intuitively engaged. With five planets changing signs in the first three weeks of April there is a lot of change. One of the biggest changes happens today, ensuring you are emotionally and intuitively engaged as Mars shifts his focus from work and job matters and onto your relationships. Nine days after Venus, the planet of love not only returned to your relationship sector but just as the stars were starting to align, she is joined by Mars, the planet of passion and the warrior planet of the cosmos today. Mars returns to find a dream team of planets already assembled but with the passion, drive and determination to start capitalizing on this. Beware of promoting yourself as a person of great physical and mental capacity who is not daunted by anything. Remember the stronger mule the load the heavier weight. Emotionally, you are more sensitive than what you think and show to others. Express your feelings frankly and not just your opinions. You will have to show perseverance and slow down your pace to get out of a constraint. 
Avoid heated discussions that drain you of your energy, you will gain from it, no doubt about it, and meditating will revitalize you positively. Joy, satisfaction, well-being, and good humor are on the agenda. You can act in all serenity because the harmony found will allow you to maintain better relations, evolve positively, and flourish. You can let go in peace. Our eyes in the sky. We want to veer from all the outdated norms that are holding us back, slowly but surely, one step at a time. But it's imperative to add structure to your daily vibe. Once you're able to find stability in all aspects of your day-to-day -day activities, then you'll be able to feel confident in how to go about your tasks and work. On another note, your personal views and goals are shifting, which means that you long to change your inner world. Don't be afraid to step out of your comfort zone and make strides in your life. You don't have to leave the past behind completely, but you should try to embrace a more evolved mindset. This can allow you to see situations from a clearer perspective. In fact, you'll be able to understand matters in a less emotional way, which will help you make all the necessary decisions during this luminary. Lean into your higher consciousness right now and transcend to a place of understanding, compassion, and service to those in need. Over the past two weeks, idealism has been at the helm of our decision-making, but by leaving too much up to good faith, we can miss an opportunity to ground our dreams into a realistic container. Now, we're forced to get organized. Some fantasies will need to be let go, and some simply need to be revised and reworked to bear fruit. The moon opposes illusory Neptune, suggesting that we be mindful of our energy. Others may be depending on us to keep a vision alive, but how much are we being expected to sacrifice? An additional trine to Pluto facilitates looking beneath the surface of our engagements and questioning, what is it I am really trying to achieve now? How can I transform what I am working with and embrace its highest potential? At 1.11 am, the moon begins its void of course, lasting until around dawn. Take note of any symbolism in your dreams which could further illuminate full moon manifestations. Full moon insights are still being digested, but now, we are processing with one eye towards our relationships. Yes, a personal vision is coming together, but who else will benefit from its realization? An intangible idea only serves to bolster our own imagination. If we get serious and make the intangible, tangible, it becomes something we can share with others. This prospect can be a great motivator today. Although our intuition is enhanced, it can also be a liability. We may read the room wrong or misinterpret others' statements. Our own words can be misunderstood as well. This transit puts us in touch with liminal forces and creative energies. It inspires us to interrogate the meaning of life and ask questions about the nature of reality. It's a great influence for occult students and fans of high strangeness and fantasy lore to discuss their fields of interest. Insights come through during meditation, in daydreams, and by allowing our minds to wander. We should simply be cognizant of blurring the line between fact and fiction. Mysteries and make-believe can enchant the psyche or breed suspicion and paranoia.